Yo, Reagan, we're having the day off, man. It's an awesome day off. Focus on my face, focus on my face. Okay, so the last few days have been quite busy. We've been scripting, rehearsing, teaching classes, getting feedback, walking around and getting, making dinner and watching television. <laughs> like um, any human being would do. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, but today we're having the day off. What's happening today? What is happening today? Yeah. You don't know? It's a World Masters Games. Okay. And there's 25,000 athletes. But what are they doing there, running? Oh, well, this is, this, they had the 10K this morning. Oh, yeah, earlier. Yeah. This is the half marathon. We're 20 minutes late. But that's not because we've been watching at that race. Okay, see you in a bit. Hey, guys. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what is the plan for today? The plan for today is to, well, we've already hired these bikes. Yeah. And then we're going to go cruise across to Mission Bay. I'd like you to go down this way on the footpath. Okay, we're ready. Six people on the moon. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, we've got the first technical problems here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was exactly two meters. <laughs> Everything will be all right. Don't worry about the bikes. Doesn't this look a little bit like a school outing? Yes. <laughs> everybody has the same bikes. Everybody wears the same helmet. Everybody packs like one kilogram of candy. And nobody knows what we're doing. New Zealand is so beautiful. We're trying to do an update, but it's really difficult to ride a bike in New Zealand on the other side of the road and uh, to vlog. But, but Kaylee, well. we're, doing okay. we're doing well. What is the update on the last two days or last three days, whatever? What is the update? The update is that Nat. Vampire, she's really happy with where we are. Yeah. We've definitely been the nerds of the group. So we prepared yes, we are. really early, which is good. Yeah. And that gives us the opportunity to flush our legs out today. trying to steal each other's bike so um, I was on a black one now but apparently I'm on a green one um, and I and I feel that there's a race coming up we arrived in Mission Bay by the way how do you like it chicken salad uh, but I don't want it with any cheese Chips. Mm -hmm. More fish and chips. That's right, bro. So these seagulls are so big. That looks healthy, bro. Yeah. On days like this, I always tell myself that I should do this more often. Maybe spend an extra day in New Zealand while I'm here uh, to see something of the country. It's really nice to get to know the guys a little bit better, to do something fun besides spending time in the gym. Helmets are back on. We're gonna head back to the city. Reagan could use some squats. Yeah. <laughs> Quadzilla. From here to the second going in. Wait, ready? Okay, going in. Three, two, one, go! Renee's on the head start! See you guys tomorrow. 
Hey, I'm wondering, can I borrow so or get some sheets of paper? Okay, let's talk about... Let's talk about filming week. I've been doing filming week since 2013 now, so that's about four years. And over these four years, filming week for me has changed quite a bit. In the beginning, it was super stressful. I felt so much pressure, mainly pressure that I put on myself. It's pressure that I've been putting on myself in many more aspects of my life, not only filming week. It's pressure of wanting to do a good job, wondering if you're good enough. Like it's all these kind of things that distract me from my actual goal. And I compare that with this metaphor. It is a bridge. Okay, it's a bridge. And if the bridge is about to crack because of the pressure, you can actually do two things. You can reduce the amount of traffic that travels over the bridge. Uh, the second thing you can do is make the bridge stronger. And, and that last thing is what I think happened to me over or in the last four years. Because I feel way more confident than in the beginning. And each filming week comes with pressure, but the difference between the difference between the amount of pressure that I experienced at the beginning when I was started doing this and at this moment is, is way less and, and that's because of a couple of things the first thing is a general thing and that is that things get better over time first you struggle and then you struggle less that's that's just how life goes the second thing is that I know my process meaning that I know what I have to do to come and prepare at filming day and for me that is putting in the work that needs to be done writing down what I want to say rehearsing what I want to say until the point where I don't have to think about it because the moment I don't have to think about it anymore I I start to become more myself, I start to relax, I start to enjoy it more. Um, so I just need to get to that point and, and that means putting in a lot of work. And I also know that that's different for each presenter. I know Reagan, I'm, I'm sharing a room with, uh, with Reagan, he has a whole different approach and then that's fine because um, I think everybody learns in their own way. So um, yeah, I'm actually, I'm actually super happy and I realized that today, where is it? That this is happening. So that's it for today. To be honest, I might have been falling asleep while watching Prison Break. <laughs> Any of you guys watching Prison Break? It's the fifth season and Michael Schofield is. So, so let me know what you think of it.